Uh, my final race of the day, and indeed everybody else's, will be the four-mile Grade 3 handicap. The Scottish Grand National is least looking forward again at the top National Apocalypse for Joshua Sutherland, the Gentle Blade, Leon Van Rinsburg, April Furbet, David Robertson, the Meanest Cut, Padraig Hogan, Wyatt Fettel, John Morgan, Elle Woods, Padraig Hogan, Frozen Hope, Darren Thompson, Sweet Women and Ideal Art, David Hooney, Sensi Unique, Vinnie Gerard, Dinah Wager, David Robertson, Settler, Craig Beckwith, Ironical Harold, Graham Clutterbuck, Matador, Martin Lidham, Fighting Words, John Morgan, Optimistic Beaks, Stu Gray, Billish Chatter, Vinnie Gerard, Amanda, Matt Cooper, Paul Sotilla, Alex Cherry, Tiama Vonas, Derek Hinton, Glimfire, Fredlock, Alex Cooper, and somewhere in the city at Matt Cooper at the bottom, they're away and racing already, first fence is a ditch, and they're all safely over it. And we've got as many in this just about as we had last week in the Grand National. I think it to the second. And we've got a similar handicap situation as well, but it's Wart Fettel who didn't run in the National last week. He was in the lead from Fighting Words in second. Then comes Frozen Hope and Tiama Vonas as they get down to the third of the 25. And they're all safely over it. They're not going as quickly as they did either last week or in the earlier Irish National earlier today where there was a lot of fallers due to the pace set by the John Morgan horse but the John Morgan horse doesn't appear to be setting quite such a strong pace this time but still leads by a good two and a half lengths or so to Fighting Words who's got a similar lead over Frozen Hope in third then the meanest cut with the meanest cat after that as they take the fourth they're all safely over that one ideal aren't they Early back mark, got a long, long way to go. Of course, a four mile and he kept chase this one. And Wyatt Fettel is in the lead. Drawing defence number five. Which they all successfully negotiate. Ideal Art continuing to the back marker. Settler and Summer in the city are also towards the back. As they come to this ditch, which is number six. Again, they all get over it nicely. With Wart Fettel and Fighting Words, the stable companions, one and two. Cap them back to Tiama Vonas, who's in third. And the meanest cat is after that one as they take fence seven. And Glenfire, Fredlock, and Frozen Hope, Ill Woods is after that. Then Potter Tiller, Matador the Great on the wide outside. Chinchy Unique and April Furbet, National Apocalypse, the top weight after that. Then Amanda. But it's still the Morgan pair that lead. Wart Fettel from Fighting Words. And Tioma Vonas, the meanest Captain Glimfire Redlock. In Frozen Hope and Elwoods. Slight gap then to Porter Tiller and Matador. Since you unique in Amanda. In April, Firmet tucked in between them. Just behind them is Billish Chatter and National Apocalypse. Ironical Harold is in the middle of that little group as well. With Settler and the Gentle Blade on the rail. In Optimistic Beach and Sweet Women. The back three somewhere in the city. Dino Wager and Ideal Art as they get over that next one. And we lost one there, Glenfire Fredlot. And Glenfire Fredlot has gone. It's been around for a few seasons. And it's Wart Fettel from Fighting Words as they get over number nine. We'll safely over number nine. Dinah Wager now, the back marker. Racing downhill towards fence 10. And that's another ditch taken on the downhill. They all get over it successfully with Wart Fettel the leader. Fighting Words in second. The meanest cat is third. Then Tiama Vonas. And Elle Woods with Matador on the outside as they take the next. Slow jump at the back by Dinah Wager. Still no change up top as they get to number 12. Much better jump that time by Fighting Words. A scenic move virtually alongside its stable companion, Wart Fettel. Those two are still... They've still got a three-length advantage over the... Padraig Hogan pair are now third and fourth. The meanest Cat and Elwoods, Woods. Then Tioma Vonas on the outside of Frozen Hope. Matador and Paul Sotilla with April Furbit on the inside. Then Chensi Unique and Billish Chatter. The Amanda. 
Destruction Apocalypse is coming wide as they take the 13th. Just they all get over okay. Inside the final two miles now, well past halfway. And Wark Fettel will lead over the 14th. Fighting Woods are already in second. Frozen Hope is now third, then Dominus Cat and Tiana Vonas, Portacilla and Matador. NL Woods has just been given a bit of a breather. April Furbet on the inside as they take this ditch, which is number 15, which they all got over. They all the two are a little untidy. Jumping is holding up pretty much okay so far, just lost the one. Glen Fife Redlot as they take number 16. And the one that we've done on them, we didn't. A loose horse. So past the big screen, past the winning post, just one more circuit. All the air trap to go. And it's Wart Fettel from Fighting Words in second. Hell Woods is third, then Frozen Hope and the meanest cat. Matador is next, then Tiara Vonas and Pulsatilla. April Furbit on the inside of Billish Chatter. NC Unique is also there as well. National Apocalypse is in the middle of a pack. The Gentle Blaze is going to need a split. Dino Wager continues to trail the tails, but it's Wart Fettel who's been in the lead all the way. From Stable Mate Fighting Words, he's been second all the way. And Matted all the greys now just showing through just a one greyer. Big field as they get to the 17th, which they all get over okay, although ironical Harold made a mistake at the back. Wart Fettel continuing to show the way into this next one. From Fighting Words, Matador is now clear third, then Frozen Hope and Elwood's the meanest cat is after that. Tioma Vonas, uh, April Furbit, and since a unique trying to get into it, so too is Ideal Art. Balter Tinner also coming through with the runners. They take the 19th, which is another dish. And as a fall on there, it's Optimistic Beach and Sensi Unique have gone. Both went at that one. And two down there, and Wart Fettel is still the leader coming into this next one. Wart Fettel over it in front from Fighting Words, NL Woods, Frozen Hope, Pulsar Tiller, Matador, National Apocalypse are queuing up behind these leading pair now. John Morgan pair are really. Having a battle to stay in front. Wart Fettel over the 21st in front. And on fighting words. Pulsatilla on the outside is just about third. L Woods is still there. Frozen Hope, the meanest cat as well. Matador's just lost its place. Settler's trying to come really wide. Giving away quite a bit of ground but making up some progress. Ironical Harold has dropped out the back. That one's beaten but it's Wart Fettel who suddenly found himself four lengths clear. Or fighting words and April Furbit and then Frozen Hope and Woods the meanest cat they get over the 22nd which they all successfully negotiate and Wart Fettel leads with three to jump in the Scottish National Wart Fettel from L Woods in second April Furbit then Frozen Hope and the meanest cat Gentle Blade is now got a clear run over the third last they go and it's Wart Fettel who's still in front Wart Fettel from L Woods and the meanest cat Ideal Art up the centre of the track then comes the Gentle Blade Frozen Hope and April Furbit still there over the final ditch they go and Wart Fettel jumped it really well and has got two or three lengths clear Coming down to the final fence, it's Wart Fettel from the meanest cat. Frozen Hope and Elwood surely between these four as they come down to the final fence in the Scottish National. Wart Fettel gets over it nicely in the lead. He's still three lengths clear. This is going to be an all the way win, I think, for Wart Fettel and John Morgan. The meanest cat is trying to close, but Wart Fettel is holding on comfortably. And up towards the line, Wart Fettel takes it. The meanest cat second. Frozen Hope third, then Elwood's and April for a bit. Billish Chatter finished well. Summer in the city. Was the last one to finish as ironical Harold pulled up. And it's a win for John Morgan. And turning back the clock a few seasons and John Morgan taking these long distance chases. And Wart Fettel made all. Drew an edge. An easy winner, really. For John Morgan, the meanest cat for Padre Hogan was second. Frozen Hope for Darren Thompson, third. Ill Woods for Padre Hogan was fourth. And April Furbet for David Robertson was fifth.